Uh, I used to live abroad uh, for about 30 years of my life in various countries. And I used to live in Greece, on the Greek islands, the Cyclades. And I was in North Devon. I was thinking about moving back to Greece. And so I was Googling some photos of Greece, thinking, yes, yeah, so I'd do that, sure not. And then there was this picture of this lovely white beach and, uh, you know, blue sea. I thought, oh, that's not nice. What's that? I'll click on that, thinking it was Greece. And it turned out to be the Isles of Scilly. But I didn't know that the Isles of Scilly looked like it does. I thought it was a big clippy, grey, you know, wind-blown, stormy, dark place. Basically, I went on holiday and, and came on holiday and then kind of went back to North Devon and then I moved over a month later. And since moving here, um, to be honest, I don't want to live anywhere else. It's because it makes me feel relaxed, because it makes me feel happy. It gives, somehow gives me the freedom to do what I want, but there's lots of types of silly. It's not just the white beaches and the turquoise sea and, and everything. Of course, that's gorgeous, and that's why, you know, part of the reason why I live here, but there's also a kind of a, a much ancient, older city. There are the, the, the wrecks, there's the archaeological monuments strewn everywhere around here, and it all permeates in one way or another. Now, I don't paint geography, I paint what, I paint what's going on in me. Because I'm here, that affects what comes out. What I explore in my work is um, whatever's going on inside me, to be perfectly honest. I'm very kind of eclectic and multifaceted, so many things appeal to me for no particular reason that I can discern. It's just stuff that's going on in the subconscious, I guess. There are a lot of um, uh, continuously returning things, this single figure in a fairly anonymous background. There's always, this, I think it's because it carries a sense of stillness, a kind of a mystery, really. So if someone asks me, you know, what's this about, or, or you know, it's different, I, I, most of the time I don't know. There isn't, it isn't about anything, it's just materialised through my fascination with paint and structure and texture. I'm an incredibly fast painter, it has to go quick, it has to be impetuous and uh, responsive and, and that's so much um, easier when you've got a great big brush and you just plunge it into some kind of paint or inky, dirty stuff. It's also painting, it's also an exploration of um, kind of techniques. I mean, every painting, I'm trying to find some new little way of doing something. I always like to know what happens if. It doesn't really matter if it goes wrong, because it doesn't, wrong is not what happens, it just develops.